No, I already checked it with my spot bar. Alright, so I've made it to the pond I'm going to be fishing today, and today I, I might be doing something pretty cool. Somebody has already cut out a sight fishing hole through the ice. I think I might take full advantage and use that for myself. I think it'll be really cool to sight fish some crappie today. That is the goal, to catch some crappie. Typically, I just go for whatever bites because I'm not very good at ice fishing, but today I am targeting crappie specifically. I'm going to take some home and eat some as well. I can barely see that. So that hole turned out to be a total fail. The water was just a little bit too dingy. Couldn't really actually see anything that was going on down there. I'm gonna take my auger and I'm gonna drill some holes, probably just right in the middle behind me. So got all my tip-ups at their holes right now. Now all I have to do is put shiners on all my tip-ups and then I'm gonna be jigging with a couple pieces of dead shiner. Rig it up, kinda right through the head like that. And then that's all. Well, I don't know a whole lot about catching crappies, but it's been a ghost town since I've been jigging that hole. I haven't marked a single mark. So what I think I'm going to do is drill a couple more holes out that way somewhere. And I try to jig some up over there. I'm sinking down to the bottom right there. Been doing in that hole. Time to stick and move. Marking something down there. Alright, well I'm hope I'm hoping it's recording right now. Got my first flag today, but uh, as soon as it popped, I haven't seen anything uh, moving. There was something on, it's not on now. Okay, that's what I'm looking for. That's a school of fish right there. Oh, oh no, I just got bit right there. Missed him, dang it. Couple marks down there now. Now with a couple marks, hopefully I can get bit. It'll be a little, yep, got him. Got him. What is he? Oh, it's a little large mouth. So uh, that what was down there, you guys can actually still see the other fish down there. Oh, already popped out. Not a crappie, but I'll take that. Nothing else doing in this hole. Let's keep her moving. Let's 
try a new hole. Yeah, I do. Oh, lots of fish down here too. Lots of fish right here too. Yeah, there's a school underneath me. But of course, as soon as I get all the way down there, my flag goes up all the way down here. Yeah, something's on it. I think I just felt them drop it. on this time got him feels like a crappie feels like a crappie it is a crappie that's what I'm talking about and a nice one too not a uh, bad crappie to keep all right that's one crappie all right that's my last battery so one more crappy. One more crappy is gonna be a good meal for me. moving spots one more time i'm actually gonna move closer to where i caught that big crappie oh come on oh heavy heavy Coming right big at crappie, me though. Big crappie, big crappie. Wow. Dude, yep. It was a big crappie. Good God. Don't you love it when a plan comes together? A big crappie. Dude, I hope it's a big largey, man. That was cool. We saw a little tap in the rod and sure enough, dude, that looks heavy. Well, my drag's really loose too, uh, but I'm not using heavy line on this. Ooh. He's getting close to the hole because he's freaking out. Whatever this is, is a good size to it. My drag ain't that loose. Yeah, no, your rod's bending. Oh, nice large mouth, dude. Nice large mouth. It's not a bad largey. I'd not say that's all. probably a good three. There she goes. Nice fish. That was a great fight, too. Yeah. <laughs> Still on him. Got him. Heavy. Well, there's a little bit of weight. Very crappie feeling. Very crappie feeling. And you got a... Oh, large oh, large mouth. Not a bad largey. Now this is where the large mouth are going to start hitting. Ah, uh, cool. A little large mouth right here. Some good color to that largey, too. Get them right back down the hole. We ran out of shiners. My buddy's just gonna jig for a few more minutes. And then uh, I'm gonna get out of here and cook up some of these crappie. So made it to the humble abode. And now the only thing we have left to do is fillet those crappie in there. And then put them on the oven. All right, got the fillets. Now what I'm going to do is use some of this Uncle Buck's fish batter. I'm going to be using canola oil as well. And then finished product are going to be up top here. 
That way, that towel there is gonna dry off any excess oil. Now, into the dry stuff. Into the wet stuff. Back into the dry stuff. And now we just let it sizzle for a while. Then I got some coleslaw for a side. We're gonna start with just this little nugget here. Sorry it's pretty dark in here, but. All right. That's good. Good oh. react. Are you alive? Yeah. Got one piece left. I'm so full right now. Fantastic. Now I'm not going to say it's as good as walleye. Now if I was a little bit more experienced filleting and cooking, I'm sure this would have turned out even better. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Peace.